Uh, welcome to the stream, uh, Mercury. Bear with me just a moment. I'm just getting a poll set up, so hopefully this is good. Okay, um, let me just make sure I have all this set up. Okay, so let's see how this works here. If I click start okay so it sent out the poll for the next stream title or stream option Let's set it up under this. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, let's just go ahead and get started here. So, um, <clears throat> it may just be me solo here today. Um, not sure if Jupiter is going to be free to join us, um, but if she does, then of course, um, you know, we'll see her here. Now, we're just doing some stuff here. What did we do last stream? We just got to this city, so I think we have to go to an inn. And we also have a mission side quest to go beat up some of the local wildlife. Okay, um, I'm gonna check what the Merc group is looking like. So we're still at level 1, where we're at 50 out of 500. Uh, that's a 20 minute mission. So Adenine has a skill towards that. Ah, oh, dang it, we really need... Okay, so let's go ahead and equip her. And I think that's everyone. Wait, no, you can. 
they're not a bit ball. Gosh, these icons are so much smaller on this screen. I guess the only other bitball person I have here is Boreas, so let's just go ahead and send them over. And they'll uh, return in 16 minutes, okay. That does mean that Nia is kind of out of blades, so let's give her that one, and I guess we can give her uh, Dagus as well. Okay. I think what we'll start off doing, though, is we're going to go down to the lower level so that we can grind off some of the enemies here just for some of the side quests. Uh, just to get us started. Uh... Pidede? Huh. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back, uh, Mercury. Uh, yes, it is waifu time. Um, <clears throat> waifu Saturday, I guess. What have we here? Oh, um... To vote for Earthbound, you have to use the exclamation mark in front of vote. Awesome! Thank you for that! Um, I appreciate that. Oh, no worries. Um, so yeah, those are just two of the titles um, that we're thinking of doing. Um, Jupiter mentioned trying to do uh, Bayonetta 2, just as a... What do you say? As like an extra option, just in case, but... Um... Yeah. Oh, the colon and the exclamation mark are next to each other. And as you might know... I don't know how to count. <laughs> no worries. Uh, you are perfectly okay. Um, but yeah, so, uh, whichever one kind of wins the, uh, the vote here, um, which right now it's a landslide for, you know, Earthbound, um, we'll go ahead and, uh, do that after we complete the Hat and Time stream, um, or finish the game. I'm very sure we're gonna complete it, though, um, with next stream, because there isn't too much left in that game. Um, Earthbound as in the second, Mother 2? Uh, yes, no, that's right. Um, it is technically the sequel, but the, the only one that was actually localized, um, for a very long time. Oh wait, actually no, they released the first game. I forgot that they did that. Um, but yeah, it's a pretty cool RPG. It's got a lot of very quirky dialogue in it, um, and like, style, I guess. Uh, yeah, I heard the first was released as Earthbound Origins or something like that. Yeah, it's like Origins or Beginning, I don't remember. Um, I purchased it and played like five minutes of it, but I did not enjoy it. <laughs> Um, I don't know, it just was a little too old, if that makes sense, um, of like an RPG style for me, which is a bit unfortunate, of course. Um, here, let's take those, yeah, no, let's take those out. Yeah, so I had purchased that one, um, Oh gosh, how far did I get? Because I I know that I only did like the main encounter. And then you could go in his basement and there was like a ton of enemies or something. 
Um, I know Nintendo fans are always like, when's Mother 3? Yeah, no, that's fair. I have actually played Mother 3 as well. It's very good, but it's got its own problems as well, so... Uh. I'm trying to find, like, the best way to describe it. It's like... The game plays a lot. Oh my gosh, we are getting wrecked. Jeez. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, dang it, he is down again. Um, okay, let's get a healing potion out. Good. Okay. Jeez. Mia, can you give us healing? Please? Please? Oh no. Okay. Oh, come on, come on. Um, dated? Yeah, it's a little dated with some of... with like some of the topics, or, and like, it's like... How do I say it? There are characters that are like, supposed to be this like, non-gendered... These like, non-gendered beings, but like, at the same time, they're all just drawn as like... Oh, um, that are all just like kind of like done as like um, men, but in women's clothes. It's bad. I really don't like it. <laughs> um, it's like one part I really dislike. There's also technically like animal abuse in the game, so that's something to keep in mind. Um, yeah. The nine... the nineties. Um, Mother 3 was in 2006. <laughs> um, but yeah. Um, Earthbound is like a little bit more tame because the story really doesn't matter, if that makes sense. Um, Uh, not even the first game was in 89, apparently. Oh, wow. Yeah, I think that sounds about right, actually. Um... But yeah, I just have, like, certain, like, qualms or... I have certain problems with, like, Mother 3. Um, but I ultimately like to play it a bit more just because of the gameplays. They like, they fixed up a lot of the problems I had with Earthbound, um, but yeah. So if that one wins, I'm totally fine with playing it. It's been like a couple years since I've actually like gone through and played Earthbound, so it'll be pretty fun to revisit. Oh, we can launch it. There we go. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> oh, bound. I'm trying to, like, uh, that was the closest I could get to the seals. <laughs> um. So, my apologies for the disappointing <laughs> attempt. Land Ball. Okay, um, let's get these all out of here. Magnificent. 
<clears throat> Offhand, I do know that Jupiter has not actually really seen Earthbound either, so um, that'd be fun if we get to that one. It was one of the one of the titles that we um, talked about, like possibly doing. Okay. Oh, she can do launch with that. Oh shit! I did the wrong move. Damn it. So I don't think, um, let me say, I don't think this this design was supposed to be like especially like horny with the, the giant bird rock, but like the the treasure things, the, the treasure bags look, yeah, I don't know. Because I, I think they said that it wasn't supposed to be, but I'm just like, but was it? <laughs> was it not H-word? <laughs> um, yeah, I know it's a classic and a lot of people love it, but that's it. <laughs> yeah, no worries. Um, it looks like pillow boobs. <laughs> oh dear. This is ice, but no one has that, unfortunately. Let's do Korra. Jupiter just texted me. She said that she'll join us in the stream a bit later. She's just got to go um, do something, um, is basically what she mentioned. So um, <clears throat> she'll join us later, um, but yeah. Oh, also, I don't remember if I read your comment. I don't think I did. Um, but like the character, it looks like pillow boobs. And yes, I do fully agree. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, I did. Okay. I just can't. I'm just like, instead of object permanence, I have like mental permanence. <laughs> yeah. Just having a little bit of coffee to wake myself up. Um, yeah, that it's potentially accidental each word. <laughs> yes, exactly. Um, it do be that way. It's true. Um, okay. So let's. Uh, who do we have the. Oh, shoot, Pededes at the base of this place. Whoops. Okay. Let's go down to Pedede. At the dock. Mmm, Timel. And, okay, there's Pedede. Okay, cool. So we got that side quest taken care of. Road to the capital. We just needed to kill local wildlife um, because I guess um, the affinity reward number two. Okay, uh, let's check them. Being with 
the driver means constant progress. My conversation skills have improved. Behold, the power of a true blade. Don't waste my talents. New abilities acquired. Okay, so that was everybody. How much time do we have left? So this game has like a Smash Bros. like um, ultimate system where you send like your your blades out on these like timed quests, and it helps um, it helps fill some of their um, some of their skill tree requirements, especially for some of the mundane stuff of like go fight on, X amount of such enemy. Um, so it's like pretty good um, to utilize it for that, but what's annoying is that it's only the the time counted is only like in game time, which is super um, frustrating. Um, <laughs> bring me five bear asses! <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> yeah. Oh okay. Jupiter says she is ready now. Let me add her to the stream. Hey, us again. All friends return safely. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? I'm well. Welcome to the stream. Hooray. Did, did we figure out who Tora's father is? Who obviously made a really wise choice to abandon the child. <laughs> uh, no, we have not um, figured that out yet, unfortunately. Oh, dang. Well, I hope the father's like, wow, you're a disappointment. I'm not even mad. Just <laughs> disappointed. Like an actual father mm -hmm. would be. There. I also gave you um, a thing here, so that way if you want to see the actual live stuff instead of the delayed Twitch version, you can. Yeah, I'm watching it right now. I see it. Cool. So glad you have a phone from this century. <laughs> um, also, uh, Mercury says hello. Hello, everyone. How is y'all doing? Hey, look what I found. Congratulations. Hey, so we got to the roof. Oops. Oh, here we go. Wow. We have to go to uh, Jacolo's Inn. Is everyone ready? Um, for what? For the hot spring cutscene? <sighs> it says your stream's paused, so I'm trying to see. I don't. I can't see it. Still loading. Oh, what do you mean it's paused? I think my, like, uh, it's still loading on my end, basically. Oh, gotcha. Hmm. No worries. Yeah, I think it's just internet lagging right now. Yeah, you're fine. Ah, that feels good. Such Mercury says, I am not ready, but I feel like I, I have way. to see it anyway. Hang on. Yep. Should you even be in the bath? Won't you rest or something? There's no problem. Poppy made from special alloy. No rust or need for oil. Tora thought of everything, huh? Master Pan is finest artificial blade maker in all the world. So Mia has no fur. No. 
She shaves every day. No, she's got like a skin condition. She's the hairless cat of the cat species. Is there a problem? I I guess not. But there's like, oh, this this water's not is not hot enough, and then she nice magically makes it hotter. She's just but like, but it's really she farted in the pool. Water. When I told her there was a hot spring here, Mithra was. She's body bald. I'm trying it out. Oh God. So, here I am. Must be interesting for you guys. Fan service time. Look, they even modeled feet and toes. It's cursed. Also, she's I mean, swimming. Anyway, I guess. I think I'm heading out. Nia, are you? Mm, well, yeah. Do you want us to keep this quiet? I'd appreciate it. Yeah, for now. <laughs> Potato feet. Oh, jeez. <laughs> You got it. Thanks. I know the mod of someone Does like Mia modern have Messi the can... gaze? Yes. Oh god. <laughs> Obviously. That was a good bath. Mithra seemed very pleased. Well, it was my first bath in 500 years. I think I have the right to savor it. That's really gross. Switch whenever. Is but she I, is that one white person that only baths for a month? Our mm. memories are shared. She's like, so it it's how you keep you your hair control. so Ooh. alive. Sounds pretty handy. <laughs> and then I proceed to vomit. Hey, what the hell was that? God. I cannot say. It sounds like some kind of disturbance. Let's find out. Come on. Huh. What's that look for? Oh, I was just surprised to see you. You'd rather I was her? I, I didn't mean it like <clears> that. <laughs> God, I, I kind of find Mithra like a very annoying tsundere in this, in this she game. She is. Like, it's not even endearing, it's just annoying. Mm -hmm. you need like, she's becoming a bitch. And I hate it. <laughs> Um, she is the Nia Becky just that tells like, Rex. Is... You mean as Mithra? Oh, goodness. I was just gonna yeah. say Nia tells uh, Rex like she isn't tsundere to, to you. She just hates you. <laughs> Get over it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, these Badoka dogs are so disturbing. She is so it grating, says Mercury. She is. Like, God, Nia at least is likable. Mm -hmm. And I mean, and funny know. and a character. I'd like to learn more I'm gonna be too. honest though. I like Mithra more only because I think Pyra story? is really any from her, boring. Really? Oh yeah, no. Really? Um, I'm not gonna lie. Be more you know what? Mithra has a well, character and she's unlikable. Well, Pyra has nothing. Mean? She's just like. What's that? Um. For? No, I just thought. <clears throat> It's been fun, What's that like one meme that's like, honey, it's time Pyra. for your penis flattening no, appointment, and they're like, <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, um, or whatever it was. Um, that's yeah. how I feel Pyra is, the one that's going like, yes. <laughs> With Mithra, Mithra's like, honey, it's my turn to take over the body, oh, yes. Gets mad at me for being also, I think Mithra's sometimes. outfit's a little, a lot oh better too God. than Pyra's. It's something. Yeah. It's... <sighs> Was that over there? Looks like it, it is, but it's not by much. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I agree. It's just something. I don't know what's throw me off with Pyra's outfit that I really hate about it. I don't like her g-string thong that she has on her like short shorts. Yeah. That's the best way to put it. Um, okay, so we have Mithra, who's the most broken character of the game, which is great. I have something 
Mm. There. So I gave her the Smash Bros. Um, sensor, which is honestly the better design anyway. <laughs> um, yeah. So yeah, so basically it covers up the keyhole that they do, and she has um, like red tights, um, as well as her back is... Um, how do you say? It, it has like a red, like... Um, sheer kind of look on it so it looks yeah. a lot nope. better this is a yeah. way better design yeah no it's pretty good a lot better says mercury listen when we're given these crumbs i have to just give up <laughs> i mean at least it's not too horny at least this yeah. outfit doesn't look horny on main yeah it just looks like um anime fan tries to draw waifu yeah but like in a good way i don't know mm -hmm. i still just oh gosh no matter how much i play this game i still find the um <clears throat> just like her like boobs to be so massive there's like no yeah. getting around it you see, Rex even said, my thoughts exactly. We're on the same page. Oh goodness. <laughs> um, so the reason why Mithra is like broken is because she has a high critical stat, and one of her abilities is that it recharges your arts um, based on if you get a critical, and depending on how much you level up that uh, skill, you can basically have it so that she is always recharging your attacks because she's always getting a critical, if that makes sense. She's Louise. It's pretty broken. Um, and the prequel story that they added um, definitely tried to nerf it. Oh jeez, Mercury says my thoughts exactly. <laughs> I like your attitude. Mm -hmm. <laughs> also, I set up a poll. Um, it refreshes like every 20 lines, but basically um, <clears throat> I added um, one more game to the idea of like which we should do next. Yeah, the poll... I'm sorry, the poll command doesn't work. It's kind of annoying. I don't know how to fix it. Um, but it basically is, what should our next stream uh, game be after Hat in Time? And it's just Bayonetta 2 or Earthbound. So, um, you put uh, vote, oh sorry, you put command, what is it called again? Exclamation mark, um, vote, space, and then you either put Bayo, for Bayonetta 2 or Earthbound for Earthbound. I could have done this blindfolded. Poppy power. Did you get that? Oh, oh sorry, I was muted. Yeah, I got this. Uh, do I need to capitalize Earthbound? It doesn't matter. Okay. Oh no! You broke the pole <laughs> by using the pole command. No. Oh wait, no, you didn't. Um, it's because you need to do exclamation mark vote space earthbound. Oh, okay. I'm going. Okay. There we go. And you got the confirmation of you voted on Earthbound. Yes. Um, I'm down to make our, our 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 super special PSI attack, PSI ACAB, or PSI Antifa. <laughs> Oof. 
Who's this 9S motherfucker? 9S. <laughs> I'm joking. It's 4D for, like, as in cup size, get it? Haha. -ha. Oh god. Oh god, I, I hate you. I hate this, you know? I hate this. You're welcome. But her cup size, as measured by the gross fans, is actually a G. <laughs> that's... Uh, that's not even a G cup. This is the thing. Mm -hmm. Like, G cups are not that big. Lila? Wait! Lila! Wait up, Tora! <laughs> Look at that man with his little gold chained, um... Pocket watch. Okay, so there's a big old maid. It's Let Tora's me guess, this old is wifey. Tora's like first first like attempt at making a blade, and so it's technically Poppy's like older sister or something, right? <laughs> He's is like that what it is? Poppy, you better call her mommy pawn. No. Oh fuck! I don't think I can. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, we died. Oh my god. Who knew steam is hot? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Why would Mithril die? She's literally made out of nuclear power. Cause she's like, ooh, it was just a little too hot. Ooh. -woo. She's literally a microwave. She is literally a nuclear power plant. <laughs> oh, she likes staple she food. She sells steam. I don't understand. I don't understand. Oh, he likes juicy salmon. Oops, the wrong one. Sometimes I like to grab Tora and yeet him into the sun. You know what? I support it. <laughs> <laughs> Sign up, adopt Poppy, and then yeet Tora into the sun. That's what I do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, also, welcome to the stream, Ed's Knife. Uh, hope your game is, er, hope your day is going good. The game we're doing is some more of Xenoblade. Also, yeah. just wanted to let you know we've got a poll up for what the next game after A Hat in Time is gonna be. <laughs> I really, okay, for a moment I did think <laughs> Mercury said, Ho, Ed's Knife. That was something that I was willing to accept, they would say. <laughs> Adventure ho! Yeah, but again, welcome to the stream. Um, let's go this way. Oh. So yeah, feel free to um, type the exclamation mark boat space, and then either Bayo for Bayonetta 2, or Earthbound, um, <clears throat> yeah. just to What if I create a bot that makes 600 Twitch accounts that'll all vote on your poll for Earthbound? Okay, but like, if they do that, can they just like, at least have four of them, uh, like, follow me so that way I can, um, <clears throat> So that way I can just get to affiliate already. I literally need four followers till we get to oh affiliate. <laughs> We're so close. We're getting there. I know. <laughs> also, we get the ability to make an emote once we become an affiliate. So that's cool. I'll, I don't know I'll what make, we're going to do. 
I'm gonna make like Jill Valentine, but like she's got like in that remember that cartoon with Jill Valentine and maybe it's like I had enough of this shit, maybe I can make that an emote. Uh sure. How many is it? Fifty? Yeah, we have to reach uh fifty. Right now we are at 46. Last I checked. Um, and we need... Okay, they need wind element. Okay, good, good, good. That. Now let's break this door down. <laughs> Ye, I saw um, 46, so math says plus 4 is 50. God, I sure hope it does. <laughs> <laughs> Someone unsubscribes to you, and you just, you, you, you gotta do 5 instead of 4. Oh, jeez. Ah, uh, wait. Oh, that's the way I went. That was the wrong way. Okay. Let's go We need to make you a VTuber. We need to make a VTuber. That's how you're gonna get, like, followers right away. We need to make you a VTuber. Oh, God. <laughs> what would it even be? It is the way. Well, what do you want it to be? It could be whatever it wants. What if it's, like, a floating hamburger? <laughs> what if it is a floating ham- Hamburger and the Twitch emote is just the Hamburglar. <laughs> what if I make you an anime version of the Hamburglar? But because of copyright, I we, we alter the colors a bit and maybe make the hair a different version. Look a little different. We make anime Hamburglar. Yeah, just make it the Bug Snacks Bunger thing. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Mercury Mercury says? Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, you can say it. Yeah. Uh, Mercury mentioned I'm considering becoming a, a VTuber, but I don't know how to use live 2D. Um, I have the floating hamburger on face rig. <laughs> um, and then Ed's knife said, VTuber cringe, maybe that's the point. <laughs> You're cringe. Mercury then said you. Yeah. Yep. Oh, hey, there's nothing about cringe anyway. The re because the real cringe at the end of the day is Elon Musk. That's the cringe. <laughs> Millionaires trying to be hip with the kids will always be the real cringe culture. Oh, Teenagers yeah. are just living their lives. Kids are just having fun. And then some millionaire is like, Oh, how do you like my Sonic OC? Only nice words, ooh, ooh, and then people just like, yo, yo, see, fucking sucks. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um, maybe the real cringe was the friends we made along the way. I mean, it really is, though. <laughs> oh, dang it. I mean, <clears throat> what if. Okay, so, what if we. Fuse the hamburger. Okay, we gotta like keep it copyright free, so we gotta fuse the hamburger with another character. I'm pretty certain that if you fuse two copyrights together, it, it won't it won't fuck up or something, right? I'm sorry, what? I'm I'm thinking if we if we fuse a copyrighted character with another copyrighted character, I think they can't I think it's in grounds for parody or satire, so it's under mm -hmm. the fair use. If it hmm. utilizes similarities, that's what I'm thinking here. So maybe, maybe we can we can like utilize a VTuber that looks like the Hamburglar, where we gotta fuse it with another character. So what other character would you fuse the Hamburglar with? The Burger King. <laughs> okay, but the Hamburglars don't turn the Hamburglar into a monarchist. 
Okay, fine. His girlfriend is Wendy. That's why he <laughs> has left the scene a class traitor. Oh my god. Okay, then that's your VTuber now, is Wendy meets the Hamburglar. I think I can make it. Jeez. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna see if I can make you a Wendy mixed Hamburg Hamburglar anime waifu VTuber, and that's gonna give us to be- that's gonna make us become a Twitch affiliate. That's what we gotta do. Okay, this dude needs to die already. Mercury says, did you say millionaires? As Knife says, are you talking Elon from on Twitter? I love Elon from his Joe Rogan appearances. Elon's a fucking cringe uh, millionaire uh, uh, dude who's a loser. That's what I'm gonna say. A fucking loser, and um, he deserves to be guillotined. There's nothing cool about him. He is complete cringe, is what I'm gonna say. I, like, hope you are being just sarcastic. <laughs> um... But it's the fear that you're not. Murphy says, Elon is worth more than a hundred billion in imagined thinking. He can relate to nor- he can imagine he can relate to normal people. And then Murphy said the wind burglar. The Ooh. wind burglar? Yeah, because it's Windy and Hamburglar. The wind burglar. I can see it. I can see it now. The wind burglar. Like, hey, it's me, the Wind Burglar, here to serve you a side of cringe. Hey, hey. Yeah, um. Okay, uh, thanks for <laughs> saying it. Um. Oh no, Ed Knight does listen to Joe Rogan. Oh no. Oof. That's just an oof from us. <laughs> yeah, uh, I agree with Mercury here. Joe Rogan is a right wing. Um, uh, he he is a right wing douche dude, and I think he he platforms a lot of people that shouldn't be platformed. Is what I'm saying. You know? Yeah, I get you. I'm just ho yeah. God. I won't. I why can't I just level up easily in an RPG? So when we, uh, so what part of the plot are we at? Like, what are we trying to solve here? Are we trying to be like, who is this mysterious killer assassin maid girl? Um, yeah, that's kind of like basically what's going on. Um, I'm just trying to figure out who this, um, <clears throat> maid character is and why they have, I guess why they're a maid is big hint foreshadow i don't know it's like it's like one of those things where the game thinks it's being clever but it's not made assassins oh dear okay ed's knife um 
yeah, we're gonna have to ask you to please stop. Um, <clears throat> uh, just kind of going on about Elon Musk and um, Joe Rogan, honestly. Yeah, can we please stop with the Elon Musk stuff? Like, he's not, uh, he's a millionaire. He's, uh, whose wealth is built on the apartheid of South Africa. So it's like, he's, it, no matter what, like, he, he does, he's literally got, he literally benefits from the system. He is the system. He also won't let his workers unionize. So, like, that's, like, like he doesn't preach what he practices, is the best way to put it. Okay, let's get cross set back on Nia. Let me handle the support role. Oh jeez. So in Smash Bros, because you had done this more than I did, did the um oh, okay, hold on. What's Is Smash Bros? Uh Ultimate. Um <clears throat> did did, like, the thing where you sent out, like, the spirits, was it, like, based on your in-game time, or was it based on real time for, like, those, like, counters? Do you for, remember like, or no? For, like, the spirit, like, getting the spirits? Um, no, I'm talking about how... <clears throat> how when you would send them, like, on the mining expeditions or whatever the the theme quote-unquote was was it like based on like real world time like 20 minutes as an example or was it like 20 minutes of game time i think it was 20 minutes real time pretty certain it was i'm not here where did she go tora wait did you know that girl she seemed somehow similar to Poppy. It was Lila. Lila? The artificial blade Tora's dad upon and Grampy Pon were making. Tora recognized her anywhere. Master Pon, there an ether furnace reading nearby. Up there. Oh, look. There Mer she is staring at us from a ledge. Her eyes filled with disgust. <laughs> She'll never speak to me ever again. I'd ra she she what throws the... herself off a building, being like, "I'd rather die than have to look at you again." Yeah. Oh my God. She has okay. She has like jets like on her waist, under the dress, as well as on her back. What is the point? <laughs> oh jeez. Yep. Okay, let's go ahead and do rolling. Oh, I didn't even... Shoot, I didn't even, like, equip cross-set. Shit. Oh, dear. Can you do it right now, or...? No, you can only do it um, from the menu. You can't access it during any um, fights. Oh, goodness. Yeah, it should be fine. Um, this cross-set is a much better, like... Fighter, um, in place of um, what is the character's name? Her her electric blade that she has. Mhm. Mm Cora, that's what it is. Um, cause like, okay, so like Cora's gimmick is that like she heals you as you move, but you don't move a lot in this game. <laughs> You're, the whole thing is like you've got to be set up in the right position already. Yeah. Okay, so let's not do the lightning bolt. There. 
Okay, now we're at stage two. And now Nia can do that. I wonder if we can get a dark ability. Shit, wait, he is the only one with fire. Unless we have him do the second tier for... Okay. Okay, so we have one seal from water. Okay, let's do that. Okay, so we got. And okay, this is gonna suck because, like, I actually don't have elements that can shatter these very easily. Hmm. Oh, yes, but I did want to congratulate you on being closer to graduation. So that's pretty neat. Hear me? Sorry, I'm reading a webcomic right now. I was reading the latest chapter of this webcomic, so yeah, you can repeat, please. I just said congratulations on being closer to graduation. I mean, yeah, yeah. It's wild. That is indeed a poggers moment. Very poggers. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm a C. I'm a computer science major. Darn! I was gonna be like, guess what my guess what my major is, but y'all already, most of y'all already know my major, so. <laughs> okay, we have three specials that we've done. Hmm. Oops. Oh jeez. And then Mercury said, I'm also a major pain. Oh goodness. <laughs> yeah, I really need to unlock the art cancelling ability. Invincible. Okay. There we go. Damn it. That was too. I was too slow on that. Mithra, hurry up. Okay, there. Now we got Supernova. So that's not going to be a good one. One, eight. Okay, 
We, yes, we can topple her. That. And smash. Okay, she has low enough health, so we should now be able to take her out. So we've got Telos, but... Okay, I just finished the chapter I was reading of this webcomic. I, it's it's kind of going yes. a little bit slow, like it's taking a really long time to build up its story. Mm -hmm. And I think it doesn't help because like webtoons is such a weekly thing that like the flow of a story kind of has to be based on like how long you can kind of keep it as a weekly format. Yeah. So they don't really get a lot of like editing with their stories done. And I don't know, I feel like it's starting to drag, but I'm just latching onto it because like the main character gives me super big punk ace vibes and I'm just here for it, you know? Oh, interesting. Because every time there's like a romantic moment... And tonight we're just saying that this is an LGBT plus friendly place, so, uh, yeah, Joe Rogan doesn't, you know, do some yeah. shit. So, that's, you know, we're not really for it, so that's kind of why we asked you to stop. I don't want to have to, like, you know, block you from the stream or anything like that. Um, that's just why we asked, you know, to just change the subject, so please drop it. And that is your warning now. Yeah. Um, wait, we just did... Ah, but we don't have ice. That's right. Alright, I have to go get some food, so I'll be later. Yeah, take your time. Alright, I'll hopefully be back in, like, maybe... Half an hour at max, maybe. I don't know. Watch yeah, me say, like, yeah. I'll be back in half an hour, and then I just will not be back for the rest of the stream or something. <laughs> You're perfectly fine. Um, go get yeah. some food. All right. Later. Later. <laughs> I was trying to rhyme something, but I blanked. Take care. Bon appetit, oh no. <laughs> oh jeez. Probability of success falling. Switching to strategic retreat mode. Lila! Wait! Oh jeez, her little arm flappy <laughs> animation there. Okay. I'm gonna save that because that was quite a mission. But, oh god. Oh. Really? Oh, no. We're, we're not doing that. <laughs> man just called all the dudes. Ah, damn it. We're not far enough. Alright, we're gonna jump to the abyss. Oh wait, no. Oh, we learned Kaiser Zone. <laughs> well, <laughs> I have no mouth and I must hold well, I'll give you props for that. <laughs> You're fine, Mercury. I'll take your word on it. Okay, let's get cross set back on... Oh, no. Nia. That way she has a better fire. And, okay, let's do a little bit of the um, Gachapon system here.
we're just going to do it only for Tora here. Or not Tora, gosh. Um, Rex. And let's just see if we can get um, one new character, possibly. Gotcha time! I know. <laughs> Okay, just a regular. Goodbye, Ichiro. Let's do... Let's do one more common after this one if we still don't get it, and then we'll do a rare, and then one legendary. Hmm. I think it's just another... regular. Let's do one more regular here and see what we get. Yeah, no, that's that's actually kind of funny. I, I thought about that too. Um, the the basic ones do kind of remind me of something out of Warzone. And nope. Okay, let's try one rare. View this. We also have the beast. Um, we also have the beast crypt crystal, which is a guaranteed pull because it's for a specific character. Um, but hopefully, we don't have to use it. I guess we'll see here. Oh man. Let's try one more rare. View the awakening. Getting anything here. I don't want to use one of the legendary ones just yet because we still haven't actually gotten anything. Hmm. It's just sad when you can't get a big titted, you know, waifu character. <laughs> Go ahead, uh, Mercury. Uh, what else is legendary? Oh wait, I think we got something. <gasps> oh, we did. This stream, oh, <laughs> thanks. One freshly hatched finch at your service. Are you Finch's new driver? Finch's name is. Uh, what was it again? Um, sorry. Well, I we can't didn't get um <clears throat> a big titted lesbian, but we did get a bird. Oh, 
Oh dear, bird is the word. What am I supposed to be working on? Ah, and they're a tank. Oh well. Here, um, yeah, it's probably not good for Rex to use it just yet. Wait, she has four fingers? Wait, are you concerned at the fact that she has fingers or that she has four fingers? Let's get going. Yeah, I get that. I mean, to be fair, their, like, beak and thing is, like, just a, how do you say, like, just like a headpiece, so, whatever. <laughs> yeah, it is one of the weird ones, uh, to be honest. Yeah, Let's go to 33. Thank god for this system because I do not want to have to grind in this game. <laughs> okay, um, let's continue on. I'm just waiting for us to actually get, like, more characters. Uh, Cineblade's design is confusing and horny. Yeah, <laughs> no it is, uh, especially for this one. Well, I don't want to, well, I don't want to discredit the first game because it does have its pretty big moments, like the first female, like, party member you find is just, like, kind of sexualized to no end with all of her costumes you can collect. Um, so yeah. She's gone. Ether furnace reading lost. It seems she has escaped. Lila. Long time ago, Grandpa Ponsusu and Dada Pontatazo were working on her. Her name was Lila. Grandpa Pon and Dada Pon and Tora all wanted to become driver. So like how come Tora is like the only one who's However, just like straight sure up nude in this attention. flashback? So we decide to work together. Data pawn. Yeah, no, it's like the it's like the language quirk they have. Use. So that just means like their father. But then Oh, they got a gun. Oh, it's more of like a rifle. You must run, Tora. Take this and go. Someday you finish what we started. After that, Tora hide out in Torigov City, making Poppy based on blueprints and ether furnace that upon left for Tora. Don't you have any idea who the attackers were? Tora not know who. <laughs> Wait, what? Grampy Pond and Dada Pond, and then what about? Wait, what? Wei Wei Pond Pond Pond? What is that a reference to, Mercury? Tora have no idea. But one thing is most confusing. What's that? When bad guys attacked the lab, Lila was not finished. You don't know the song Pon Pon Pon? No, I don't. What is that? Which means Remember that I'm uncultured. Still be alive somewhere? Dadapon must be held captive by whoever using Lila. 
You there, don't move! <gasps> Imperial soldiers. You! So we meet again, driver of the Aegis. Lady Morag, she's the one! That mechanical girl took down our squad! Yeah, I just looked quickly oh, at the video. It's very J-pop, and also the imagery is really weird. They cannot tell difference between Lilac and Poppy. So, Rex, was it? Rex? The song and internet were a bit of a sensation at the time. Oh dang, from 2011? Wow. Yeah, I like also didn't have like a whole lot of access to the internet when I was like in high school. Um, so like I missed out on a lot of stuff actually, but yeah. Oh, so the chorus um, is pon pon, way way way, etc. Oh. Huh. Yeah, well, thanks for that like tidbit. <laughs> Uh, here, we should probably just take out some of these soldiers first. Okay, that one is done. Wait, by the way, I just refreshed the stream to see a thing. Oh, do you mean the title, Mercury? <laughs> oh, 45? I did notice. Yeah. <laughs> but that's okay. Yeah, uh, no worries about it. I'd rather have people who want to be here. <laughs> and we also enjoy, in a sense. <laughs> no, wait. Oh. Right. I don't have fire, so it's fine. Uh, let's see. Do not switch, Nia. Do not. Okay. Good, good, good. Ah, oh, fuck, I need to switch that. <laughs> yeah, of course, Mercury. Okay, can someone do freaking tier 3 fire already? Okay. Oh my god. Oh, she didn't even- okay, whatever. She got- she finally did the tier 3. Just ended. Okay. That's fine. Um, what do we do? Let's have them do stone. That way they can follow up with fire and then stone again, or I can do wind. Probably gonna be the best option for Morag here. Okay.
Um, I'm on WoW at the same time, uh, and I really hate this week's, like, I tile set for the roguelite thing. Oh. Oh, I think that's... I'm scared that this is gonna, like, take her out. Uh, should I just do it now? Yeah, let's just do it. Okay. Uh, by the way, your friend from yesterday uh, seems cool. Just have to mention. Yeah, Cam is very, um, is very kind. <clears throat> he used to join us on some of our earlier streams, but um, it's just a little hard sometimes because our schedules don't always line up very easily. They're like very, like, well. Um, so yesterday was just kind of one of those days where he was actually able to join us. Um, but of course I extended the invite just to let him know that, you know, he's always welcome. Okay, there we go. Uh, since we already broke it, just do the water. Did you say yesterday was just one of those days? I know, I know. I won't that power. I mean, yeah. Let's stick to foresight for this. Wait, I I said like yesterday is just one of those days that like our schedules like lined up. Oh break stuff. The Aegis has changed. What happened to her appearance? Answer me! You want answers? Then put the swords away! What's wrong with you? I'll listen to your confession. Me. While you lie, oh, defeat geez. it. I'm just like these characters are too good to be in this After game. This foresight, I'll switch to Pyra. Understood. Scottish chick is hot and also cool. Yep, I agree. Like, Impossible. I personally Impossible. think that Bridget. Now it's is like a good design like the um how do you say like the like the dress slit is a little much but it's like but it's not we can do this you know it's like you read my mind are you holding back on me again boy we just don't have any reason to fight you but yeah, I just love uh, Morag. She's I really good. Do. You're from the Argentum Guild's intelligence division. Lady Morag. Again, boy. <laughs> These not the ones who infiltrate the facility and attack your soldiers. Yeah, um, I don't know if you were in that stream, but we encountered her and like then broke some water. Um, the artificial blade how do you say like now, some kind of like right? water? They very similar, but not the Thing. same. Nira Nira saw her with own eyes. I had a feeling like a water tank. What since our arrival? I quite sorry for causing concern. Nira Nira has been auditing Please. Argentum Trade Guild. Ah, so you were keeping an eye on us because we came in on a guild ship. Watch me get more like J-pop anime recommended videos on YouTube for this uh, video you had told me about. I should not have attacked you so suddenly. My apologies. Okay. No, no, that's fine. Nobody got hurt in the end. I'm just glad it all got cleared up now. <clears throat> An apology from the illustrious Flamebringer, a rare reward in itself. I'm just like, thank god we finally gave Pyra something. Um, producer of KPP is also the producer of Capsule. I kind of like his stuff, to be honest. That's pretty neat. Um... By the way, I don't know what capsule is either, but again, I just I, I'm not very invested in it. You must tell me all. <laughs> um, to hide her boobs? I mean, yes. 
I see. It seems it would be best for all of us if we work together for the moment. Us will you. Indeed. My goal is to capture oh, the artificial. Thank you so much for the host uh, nuggets. I do appreciate it. Hope your day is going pretty good. You just told me. Um, I seek enemies to friends. Yeah. <laughs> Would you not say our interests align? Uh, I guess we so. need more entities. <laughs> Well, this game is full of it, with us <laughs> so us. if you stick we around, the there's plenty, I guess. <laughs> too lightly. If she went all out on me, even I wouldn't be able to hold back. And then, we'd burn this place to the ground. I am honored that the Aegis herself thinks so highly of me. You may not remember it, but... I faced you a few times before. Let's just say it wasn't easy. Oh, really? But that's a story for another time. What do you say, guys? I can't deny I'd rather avoid making an enemy of them. All right then. <laughs> so, Cinderella so likes on, the blue GF. <laughs> That's a ship I'll agree with. Oh, right. <laughs> no. Oh, jeez, Mercury. I can't get over that stream that I had, like, caught of yours the other day where, um, one of your followers, um, was just posting, like, um, the really bad, like, English. <laughs> And I literally, when I like, when I had like messaged in the chat of like, I cannot read this, um, I was being serious. It literally was breaking my brain <laughs> of just like the, oi mate, like just kind of the way that they like, um, typed it out. I don't know if you get what I mean, but yeah. Hmm. I get the feeling that if I stay near that boy, I might bear witness to something quite Oh, yes, Henny. That's who it was. That's a good username. <laughs> okay, so like Egad Pawn. But it's good that you work things out. Anyway. We'll see if we can track Lila down somehow ourselves. I too will see if I can find any leads. No matter what, Louis I do want to pull more gotcha, um, like crystals for more characters, but I want to wait until, um, how do you say? I want to wait until we get another party member, so that way we can like get some for them, if that makes sense. Um, that's their name. They are a wild WoW friend who also posted. <laughs> yes, no, they also posted the Uru Weedy <laughs> John thing. Oh, jeez. Um, spoiler, but our next party member is Morag and uh, Bridget. So, <clears throat> so I kind of want to hold off till we actually get them, so that we can. Um, Oh wait, no, I'm supposed to mark that as active. Whoops. Oh, crud. How do I... Oh, there it is. Uh, let's see. I have to go to that port. Jeez. Um... What always trips me up about RPGs is just these really absurdly fake names that they use for everything. Like, this is the Anang Anangam deck? Like, or doc, I mean. But I do appreciate it when it's stuff like this. Like, this is Peri Peri. I wonder where. Doofenshmirtz is at. Ha, 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 ha. 
Oh no. <laughs> Dang it, Mercury. I like her attitude <laughs> in Rex's voice. Katy Perry Perry? Oh jeez. Okay, go to the elevator that leads to the capital and search for yellow barrels. Oh, this mission. Okay, so this is kind of annoying because if I don't have the right field skills for this story mission, we have to wait like a set amount of time for us to progress the story. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay, um... Yeah, it's right here. Hello, barrels! Okay, so we don't find any. Oh yes, but earlier, I thought you were commenting on that you saw the title for my stream of Tora's Daddy Pawn Issues. That is what I initially thought you were referencing. <laughs> um, we have to go to the recycling shop. Okay. Yeah, I'm... It's funny, like... I really try to like force myself to think of really good names for the streams um, just as we go along and these streams are actually getting backed up uh, to to the YouTube um, to my YouTube channel so um, there'll, there'll at least be VODs for that um, I had uh, stopped updating them frequently so um, I do apologize about that but all the Hat in Time streams and this game stream forward will be, um, how do you say, will be, um, added to the YouTube channel. Uh, okay, so we should be, god, okay, whatever. You're doing great, sweetie, thanks. That's very nice of you. Got jokes. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> oh, they're not? Oh, I think I just haven't made them public. Yeah, there is like a gap in them. Um. I'll just make them available. Yeah, I'll just set them available after we finish the stream. Um, for those, uh, um, how do you say? For those streams. Because uh, I already got them. Um, how do you say? I already uploaded them to YouTube. I just thought I had made them public already. But eh. I'll be made public uh, shortly after the stream. So now that we've done this, let's go ahead and go to quest log, Lila. Go to the turbine tower and speak with Tinnel. Okay. Oh, what is she doing? Look what I found. Oh, she was just running into the distance. Huh. Double no. you lost the upper hand. What is DW an abbreviation of?
dual wield? Oh. Or don't worry. <laughs> Wait, why would you... Why would you... Why would you start with dual wield? Because <laughs> I assume you meant don't worry. <laughs> I see how it is, Mercury. You say that, but this entire stream is just retribution for your initial Commissar stream. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I'm glad I've opened you up to the idea that all anime dubs should be done by European voice actors. Uh, yeah, of course. I always enjoy catching your stream, so, um, just whenever you can, but don't, like, stress yourself about it. Um, <clears throat> oh my god, whoa, they are just taking so much health. Why would you say something so brave yet controversial? <laughs> Armor Scorpox. Uh, I think I should just pick a time that doesn't have like mage or overlap with friends so I can do some chilling in your stream, uh, for example. Uh, yeah, of course! Um, <clears throat> Yeah, that's kind of why I pushed my streams back a bit, um, just to like not overlap with SKs, because I do uh, try to stay for as much as I can for it. Um, that's kind of why like my streams mostly kind of uh, started later, but it's because like here where I live, we don't actually have daylight savings. We just never actually do that, so. <laughs> It's funny when like people like will you know move their stuff like up or down an hour, and I'm just like it's the same for me. Yeah, honestly, it's I don't know. Like, what's the point of daylight savings? You know, but that's just how I feel all the time. Set is an AoE, and then Poppy. Yeah, makes no sense in this day and age. Yeah. character trees to see if I can unlock the art skill already. Oh my god, just hurry up. There, and we're gonna have her do the seal stench. My first action as CEO of Earth is to abolish uh, Daylight Savings Time. Um, I'll back you at least for that. Because <laughs> again, just I don't see any purpose in it. It was like worse though, like 
when I used to work at a job and... Oh wait, let me do Smash. Okay. Um, I used to work at a job that for Daylight Savings we actually did update our shift, so like, even though, like, we don't actually participate in Daylight Savings, we still had to come in an hour earlier um, as our, like, permanent schedule change, and it was the worst. Ah, oh, fuck. Um, even as a person that doesn't work, it just hooks me up so hard because of eating at the same time. Oh yeah, no for sure. I totally understand. Um, that's like how I am, just because sometimes I get so busy with work in the morning that I don't have time to eat breakfast. Um, so that always stinks, but... Ah, uh, oh, damn it. She needs... 325 to unlock that skill. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's 278. Good work, puppy. Okay. Yeah, your internal clock just doesn't. <laughs> no, I'm I'm with you there, hundred percent. It. I remember like um, when I was young, um, like before we moved, like I did have to like deal with that, and it was just weird um, for me personally. And I'm also just like, wow, my parents really had to go and like turn down the time of every appliance in the house, um, like of every clock just to account for that hour. <laughs> or like sometimes my grandparents would just not. So they were just like, well, the time is still right. Just go back an hour. It's up to you to remember that. <laughs> it's basically how they were sometimes. Oh. Uh, okay, so if we travel down this way, this is actually where the barrels are at. Okay, bring it up. Let's keep going. There we go. An upon note. Oh, wait, yep. That's what it was. <laughs> the clock is always right somewhere in the world, <laughs> basically. Okay, so we only need... Okay, watch. If I switch Korra out for... Yes, Boreas? Should be able to complete this. There we go. Okay, cool. So I actually had enough for the field skill, um, so we don't have to do a timed mission. Okay, um... Head to the Imperial Soldier Garden for Hard Eye Gate. Oh, let's beat this giant Fable Bufa for the heck of it. Because they're right next to um, a heart to heart. Bufa tees. Oh, jeez. Oh, 
finally we have art canceling. Okay. It's gonna make everything go much faster. Okay, so we need... Does she not have break? If she's doing a heal... There and now Nia can do this weather. Before we warp to the hard eye gate, let's click on this heart to heart. So full of wasteland and hard rocks, not easy for walking. Should we take a rest, Reindeer? Good idea, yes. You need to toughen up a bit, Tora. Tora lived whole life cooped up in house working on building Poppy. Not used to walking long distance. If only Tora could flitter flutter like Gramps. Well, you have those big ear wing things. Not on wings, not for flying. Could flap forever and not reach sky. If you're really having a hard time walking, you could ask Dromart to give you a ride. Oh, Rex Rex is genius! I think not. I have solemnly sworn to carry none other than my lady. Yeah, no, they are wings, technically the little wing hands but they can't fly with it because like their hands are actually under <laughs> it's weird <laughs> go on it can't hurt what oh i like it's uh this little drill marks animation there his pose are you sure about this my lady kitty kitty <laughs> exactly if you allow Tora to ride me now, soon he will want Poppy to join him. And there will be no space left for you. Well, when you put it like that... Sorry, Tora. Guess that's a no. Ugh, much disappointed. Like we had to talk her out of it. Oh, jeez. are you okay walking? Oh, yes. I'm fine. Though all the dust clouds do bother me a little. You thought those were ears? Look at it. I guess. Oh, the pterodactyl just flew in the background. Oh yeah, those are a pain. Gets in your eyes sometimes. Poppy also not like that. Small particles get in joints and cause nasty creaking when moving. Must ask Master Bond to clean up and get out of this place. Yeah, that's a good way to think of it. He's like indoors. Incel Machamp <laughs> that doesn't exercise and is just a weeb. Rex Rex, it seemed like more ordained, tricky place for everyone. I'm Rex, so Rex, confused Rex, about these designs. Well, let's see. Oh, let's see. I could lend out my salvager suits. Or just gotta rough it out. <laughs> hmm, what you feeling, Mercury? Just gotta rough it out. All right. Ah, the old grin and bear it solution. Rex, not even try to solve problem. Well, I mean. Listening to you guys talk about it does make me think that the sand and dust is a problem. But then I realized it never actually bothered me until you mentioned it. It's not like it's making our attacks miss or anything, right? I think we're fighting as well as we ever have. It's a bit of an irritation, but it's not causing any actual problems. I suppose you're right. 
Tor is a douche, don't help him. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so I think as long as we keep our spirit strong, we can make it through this just fine. Well said, Rex. I'll do my best to keep going then. I'll try to keep my mind off it too. All right, let's keep moving, guys. Right. Is this really solution? Is best solution? <laughs> oh, okay. So there's another one. I'm just curious, what level is that beast? Oh, look at that! Stud level 85. Oh, hold on, I'm, I'm going. Oops, where's it going? It's flying away. Level 85 with my level 28 to 29 range mooks. Uh, let's go to the town. And, oh, we don't actually have a warp destination. That's fine. Okay, uh, we should get a fast travel point here, yep, and then let's go to the gates. Oh, look at that, another one. My lady, over there, the capital's standing army. I see him. Let's keep our distance, yeah? Best let sleeping gogos lie. Good call. Be not alarmed. The troops that captured us were Ardanian military, yes. Those aren't the same? Hmm, quite different, in fact. One can learn many things while in a Titan battleship's brig. And I made good use of the opportunity. Damn, they checked me into solitary, so I don't know anything. It does seem they have separate procedures for blades and drivers. In any case, once I abandoned thoughts of staging a breakout, I did make sure to keep my ears open for intelligence. Did you hear anything else? Hmm, let me think. The soldiers over there are, as I said previously, from the capital's garrison. But those other ones actually belong to the first Imperial Guard, second it's battalion. It's like a lore lesson. Huh, what's the difference? That, like, Beyond no one wants to listen to. Hard Hay Palace, the Imperial residence. Therefore... Oh, I've got it. The palace guards belong to a different unit. Of course. Indeed. Then, above the Imperial Guard rank and file, you have the Carrick Special Guard Unit. And higher yet, the Special Inquisitor. The Flame Breaker. Um, thank you for the follow, King J Plays. Um, <clears throat> thanks for joining us here. We're just playing some wow. Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Um, he's man. I could never deal with all this hierarchy crap. Ever heard the expression, know thy enemy? Got any other good I guess I'll just on? ask him, got any good ones? The smallest unit in the Ardanian army structure is the Ten Soldier Decade. It includes eight foot soldiers, alongside the squad leader and the deputy. Six to ten of these decades can then form a unit called a century. But eight is the usual number. Ah, neat. <laughs> Master Rex, you did ask for a good one, correct? I did. Would you not say that that was a good one then? Oh no. <laughs> Which part? A decade of eight. I said it commonly. Eight <laughs> oh no, poor fish. Eighty men, and yet they are a century. <laughs> oh, poor thing. Oh. He's so proud of it. Rex, he's done his best. So just throw my bow away. Ah, yeah. No, that was a very good one. Uh huh. Very good. I have doubts about your sincerity. 
Yeah, I think it's just because they're trying to say, like, of the decade, eight of those people can form a century. So it's like eight people are a century, and that was the joke. There is the notice board. Let's still pick that up. <laughs> Math is hard, so yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> oh, man, I don't ever mean to make them active. Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's head on over to the gate and see what Morag is up to. Hard Eye Palace. Oh jeez, I really need to like get some more of the dev level up so that we can try and get like increased running speed. Brain empty, no thoughts. <laughs> I'm with you there. There was indeed once a factory there. However, it was abandoned some thirty years ago. So. You think we've got him? We can't be certain unless we investigate. Shall we go? <clears throat> you. We won't do anything reckless. If it seems dangerous, we'll turn back. How's that sound? Hmm. Um, so like, are her eyes the always truth. closed? Yeah, yeah it's like so kind of weird. So I don't get that sure like anime trope now, but yeah her eyes are right always down. closed there are rumors about town that an esteemed nopon merchant is involved in this affair an oh and i guess nopon just as like a heads up merchant. of course um Chairman we're Banner. probably gonna go on for like another well, hour just for today's stream records. if we find anything we'll inform you pretty busy hey eh? I don't deny it. I will head to the location myself as soon as I am able to mobilize some troops. All right, then. Okay, um... So, we can now progress. Let's go to... Oh, wrong. We need to go to upper level... Industrial District. Okay, hopefully I can get through this area pretty easily. I always forget how to navigate this, like, little maze area. <laughs> Thanks for the kind words. Oh, fuck. Okay. Got the pipe vein. Oh, I think my item... Shit, I think the items ran out. I need to set new ones. Um, it's because of the vibes, and sometimes Welsh cat girls. <laughs> yeah. I just need to unlock um, Mia's art cancelling skill, and then like I'm gonna switch back to playing as her. Because I do actually enjoy using her um, with Crosset. Um, but mostly for the fact that, uh, you know, I control the healing, <laughs> rather than letting the AI, um, decide that, basically. Uh, it's toppled. Nope. Dang, the topple goes by so fast. Okay, let's try it now. And then, let's launch. Now we're gonna do the smash. And let's just get the bonuses. I need healing. AI stares emptily. <laughs> More like AI, um, Takes the aggro from the tank. <laughs> Enemy down. 
Awesome. Okay, so we got that. Let's open up. Uh, ah, fuck. I didn't jump fast enough. Okay. A Brish Aspar. Maybe it's just abbreviated. This is a British one. Side attack. It's how you say British in British. British. Oh, jeez. Oh, wait. Ah, hurry. Ah, damn it. Okay, I hate how long that launch attack takes. Ah, oh, and. Okay, let's just do gravity level 2. Um, oh, we took off Korra, so she doesn't have electric. Okay, thankfully we didn't get shackled. Let's topple. Oh no, no one. <laughs> What's the build up? <laughs> My brain shackled O'Neill. Oh jeez. Oh, oh perfect. So we got the chain attack. Let's See, it's got just one element. Okay, and let's use cross set to burst it. Oops. I thought she was doing a different attack. Poppy. Oh. This Telos. And let's do draw mark for the added damage. Enemy okay. Now you know Tora and friends serious. Meow. No way. We were awesome. My favorite thing is when Nia does that. Meow. Like God. Oh, perfect. I feel I could use my power. Okay, he got that skill. My firepower has increased. Cool, let's go. Oop, not accessories. Three thousand. Okay. We're almost there. Let's do that for the thirty percent chance. Bitball. Yeah, these take a while, so she's got break or healing. Let's increase the healing. Wait, so Pyramithra and Batman Bruce Wayne thing? Or is she like, uh, what's it called? Um, <laughs> when they're headmates. Oh, jeez. 
Well, the game like goes out of its way to like state that they're more um that they're supposed to be different people, which is weird. Um for that to be the case. Let's do anchor shot. Uh let's see. I actually don't even like rock. This let's do the launch, I guess. So they're headmates in a way? Yeah. It's like it just doesn't really make sense, to be honest, because like what it's described as is um Okay, I'm leaving before that battle starts. Uh, what it's described as is that, like, Mithra made Pyra. But what does that mean? <laughs> you know? Uh, let's see. Ah, oh, jeez. I don't know if this is the way... Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, we got a lot of enemies. Dang it, I forgot to put the item in my pouch. Yeah, so she's a multi-system. <laughs> um, yeah, it's just like weird. Um, ultimately, cause like... What's the point? <laughs> I guess is the, the kindest way to put it of the two characters being individuals. If they're like not actually really that different. Done. So they can do pandemic. Oh gosh. Well, Cora started the pandemic, apparently. <laughs> what was that about pandemic? Um, Tora's move. Um, that he had was um, the Earth skill, but the Earth skill was titled Pandemic. So that's just the joke I was making. <laughs> and now we're doing Final Disaster. There we go. To be honest, Tora is a plague upon mankind. <laughs> oh, jeez. Actually did a pretty large amount. Okay, now Poppy's turn. Enemy down. With this. Okay, so she's the only one that got a skill. Go back to Rex. Ouch. Lentil milkshake? Uh, no. Let's do that. Um, Nia needs stuff too. Maybe the hero's heart? 
And then let's give her, what else, what else is good? Probably something that can help recharge arts. Uh, let's just do that, I guess. And Tor as well. Let's give him an arts increasing. Oh, this is actually for specials. Uh, let's do that one. Research is progressing. Poppy's favorite. Oh, perfect. And that should mean that the skills effect amplifies, I believe. Okay. Level 33 boss. They'll leave him alone <laughs> for now. Okay. Let's try to get out of this place and at least get to the next area. Can we go down? No. Okay. There was no animation for that dropping. That's kind of weird. <laughs> Wait, is this where I was? Oh yeah, okay, so that was the entrance, so then we're just back where we started. Let's go left here again. Okay, good. Here we go. Oh, I hate these vain enemies. Leave me alone. Get the topple in, use photon. Oh, we just dang. Everything has like targeted us. Suddenly I'm craving junk food. <laughs> hey, I don't blame you there. Treat yourself, you know, every once in a while. Um, so, I mean, you know, if it's something you really want, I mean, eh, do it, I suppose, if there's no real harm. Oh, it's 2 a.m. Okay, you see, that is something that I always forget, Mercury. Because right now it's just like 6 p.m. for me, and I'm like, oh, junk food? Uh, that's like an okay thought. <laughs> Yeah. Um, that's harder to say. Because I don't want you to just eat and then it like ruins with. How do you say? Like it ruins with like your system? I don't know. You mentioned you're also a night owl, so. Uh, wish I had better things to say. <laughs> um, but I know, like, for me personally, if I eat too late, it, like, ruins with my sleep. Okay, now to take on the British Aspar. Um, I go to bed at like 6 to 7 um, on average these days. Yeah. So I'll be like 4 hours. Yeah, oh dang, wait. So Mercury, we're basically on like a very similar sleep schedule then. In terms of when we're awake. <laughs> oh dear. 
Yeah, I, I've, I've noticed it, because every once in a while I'm just like, um... Oh, Mercury hasn't shit post in a while. Maybe they're asleep. Yeah, it's 6 p.m. for me. <laughs> I like how the enemies are literally on the other side of the door. Um, it's called insomnia, sweetie. Jeez. No, I feel that though. Um, <clears throat> I usually wake up, let's see, you said it was about 2, um, where you're at. That means, how many hours? Is that... You're 8 hours ahead of me then. Um, is what it is. And like the problem- oh my god! Speed runner, more like speed racer. Oh. Um, I was gonna say, like at least for me personally, um, I have kind of been experiencing that too, so hopefully, you know, it doesn't hit you too hard. I mean, besides the fact that you just mentioned that you go to sleep at like 6 a.m. <laughs> or so. Uh, launch! Okay, and then let's smash. Cool. Build these damn. <laughs> yeah, sleep got better these days. Oh. Well, I'm glad that it's at least been a bit better. Um, geez. I'm just in a mood of like, RPG wants me to do battles in order to gain experience? Now that, I'm not for. <laughs> but this is always like a big mood whenever I like play an RPG. Ah, oh, dang it. Sometimes I play RPGs and I do not do combat. Um, for me, it's like, I like the combat, but I don't like to grind is like my personal like thing with it. Okay, how much damage? Oh, I killed it. Okay. Uh, and sometimes in the same RPG I'll be like, ugh, when's combat? I'm tired of reading. Oh jeez. Um, I felt that way whenever I play the Ace Attorney games, where I was like, can I just finish the investigation and get to the trial, which are the actual highlights of the game? How long is Xenoblade Chronicles 2? Um, what chapter are we on? We're on like chapter 3 was Van Damme, so this one... We're on chapter four, um, so I'd say we're just getting out of the early game. Because I consider like chapter three to be about the end of the tutorial stage of the game. It says about a hundred hours, average. Yeah, that's somewhere around there. Um, 
I think the first time I played this game through, it took me somewhere around 80, I want to say. Two hundred sixty hours in completionist mode. Yeah, no, I believe that. There's a side quest that takes um, about sixteen collective hours to like fully complete, and I will never do it again. Yeah, 80 is decent for an RPG. Yeah, that's about how long it took me the first time I played this game. Um, it's like... It's, that's interesting that it says 100, but I mean, you know... Folks play the game at different, you know, rates, I guess. Attack. Oh my god, what are we still fighting? Oh, that thing. It's weak to... Oh, nuclear. Ah, no wonder I killed it so easily then. Uh, well that's the average, like some side quests and main story, but not completion at 100%. It's a good ball ballpark number. Yeah, of course. Um, <clears throat> I did like most of the side quests I wanted to. Um, so I get it. Uh, okay, hold on. Oh, welcome back, Jupiter. Hope you had a... Did you have a good food break? You're muted. I'm back, bitches. What's up? When did it get so late? Don't worry. It's going pretty good. Um... <clears throat> getting some more progress done on the Xenoblade educated oh. uh, Mercury that were basically out of the tutorial part of the game. Oh god, you finally got you finally made it out. God. Well, I would say like last chapter is about the end of it. Um, basically- oh, so What? So what? Excuse me? The yeah. last chapter? The last chapter, last stream, was about the end of the tutorial zone, I would say. Yeah. Um, because combat, so like, some of the last stuff you get is the chain attack, um, mm -hmm. to do those all-out damage, um, dealing, you know, attacks. Yeah. Um, and you get that, like, um, a bit ways, um, into the third chapter, and then... And also, by beating Chapter 3, you also get the ability to add three, um, three blades into your main party. Oh, fuck, fuck. Okay. Yep. Um, because, uh, from that point earlier, you're restricted to only two in your party at a time. Like, two oh, yeah. per character. Which is slow. Because it means that you don't have a lot of move abilities as well as um, element um, element abilities or yeah. So apparently, I'm looking up the trending stuff on Twitter, and Terry Crews is apparently streaming Dang Europa. Terry Crews. He's the like oh. spice dude, old spice. Yes. I know who you're talking about. Yeah, wild. <laughs> It is a bit wild. Ugh. 
I think people don't realize how mainstream anime has been now and was. I mean, yeah. Um. Oh, right. <laughs> Mercury says, so that so means we, we are looking forward to a good amount of waifu streams? Oh, it's Shalad. Yes. yes. Wait, who's Shalad? And then Mercury says, anime is mainstream uh, AF, so are video games. Yep, exactly. Make your mind up, and what the hell is a Zekanator anyway? <laughs> you may have been lucky last time, thanks to a certain unstable cliff. But this time round, we meet on good old Terra Firma. If you think you can run from me a second time, you are quite mistaken. Nobody did any running. And anyway, um, maybe in like ten hours. <laughs> I've been wondering for a while now, but what's with the cutesy eye patch? <laughs> I'm quite glad you asked. This eye patch conceals a power too great for mere mortals to comprehend. The Eye of Shining Justice! I am sworn to keep it sealed until its power is needed to save mankind. You should count yourselves lucky. It would turn you to ash in seconds. Whatever you say, pal. He definitely isn't wearing it because he didn't have the gold for a second contact lens. How poor are you? And are you that short-sighted? By the by, what business might you have with us today? Are you thick? You know, it would be like the cherry on top of this character is if, like, his blade, all she said was rada rada. Oh, jeez. So hurry on home. she said was rada What's this? And she was just copycatting him, you know? That you wet yourself, furry ears? Did I what? You've got a lot of nerve, you one-eyed monster. N Nia, you do know one-eyed monster usually means... Huh? Means what? Um, it's, uh, Mithra, why are you blushing? Shut up! This is a great cutscene. <laughs> um, yeah, the fake eyelash. Or, not eyelash, eye patch. I mean, um... Did I miss a thing? Um, they just uh, made a joke. Um, the the phrase "wanted monster" just means like penis. What? I never knew that. Yeah. Uh, and then there was the Mithra, the Mithra line delivery of "shut up," and it was just like so flat and not really good. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go get some dinner right now. I'll be back quickly. Wait, didn't you say you left to go get food? Yes, but I'm getting to eat the food. Hmm. Let me get a plate to eat food. I'll be back, okay? You're Don't good. judge me. <laughs> I was just gonna say Jupiter is one hungry lass. Uh, two ace for this shit. <laughs> no worries, Mercury. Okay, let's do gravity. Ah, uh, so we can't do that. Yeah, so we're better off doing the tier 2. Glad Jupiter's as lost as you were. <laughs> no worries. Okay, perfect. And then Tora can do Meteorite. Oh, 
Oh shit! What? Oh shoot, how did he lose so much health? Was I just not paying attention? Huh. Oh my god, now I have the aggro. No, please stop. Oh my god, oh my god, please stop. Believe in the heart of cards. Or, I mean, the heart of the waifus. Uh, he needs to use heat. Oh my god, they won't let me switch. Fuck. Oh, they don't let me switch till next chapter. Oh my god, okay. Wait, are they gonna let you- they're not letting you switch out your blade? No, I- so, I guess, spoiler, but- not really, because it doesn't even matter. But you can switch between um, Mithra and Pyra, like forms between, like in the middle of battle. Um, so basically, the reason why um, Mithra is OP is because she's basically a fourth blade, if that makes sense, where everybody gets three, but um, she's the exception where you can get um, like an extra character. And because her skill is also really OP. Okay. Let's do this, get our EXP bonus. Uh, okay, good, it hit water. So let's use cross set. Perfect, we got the burst. Yeah, it's better to just do a tier 2. And let's just have her do this. Hopefully we can get to 300. Percent bonus, but I guess we'll see. Oh, yeah, we did. Question Do people ever eat during your online meetings at work? Um, not really. <clears throat> Mostly because we're probably too busy, or we're just, like, snacking at the very most. I'd say that's usually what it is. What's his blade again? Oh, his blade's name is Pandoria. What if all Pandora said was Zug Zug? Please. She just Zug Zug. Uh. Like, I'm waiting for, like, a blade that can only say one word. Papane, can't you do something? Sorry, sorry, sorry! I mean... There is... Wolfric, who kind of just roars and growls viscerously. Um, but that's like it. <laughs> he can talk. Come on. Okay, so it's like a Ridley situation where this creature can absolutely talk, but they just scream. Yeah, basically. Um. Hmm. Other than that. Now this. Quite the sight. I'm holding that's out that's for Earth. Yeah, that's kind of it. Once we have first thousand ether furnaces, we sell them to Torna. Oh, you know how we tell this guy's evil and rich? He's fat. You can tell because he's got a double chin. Who gave us info on core chips for Lila to steal too? 
make no difference. We go where Prophet yeah. Old Geezer can wait a bit longer for his turn. What's with the shorthands of like conveying someone's evil is that they're fat. No good. No, I feel that. That's like how I. That's what I felt like when I was watching. Um, what was that movie? Howl's Moving Castle. I was like, yeah. I'm just tired of it because it was like. It was like they tried to do like a really like detailed like character um for that one witch and it was just like gross God, that the they did that going up the stairs yeah yeah it's just awful it's like oh look at this disgusting hag you're like this lady is probably disabled and has a hard time getting up the stairs please someone give her assistance yeah um, and then she's like, Cause, like just... she go... go ahead. I was just gonna say, she just like walks around in a carriage, and I'm like, this is probably the, equ the magical equivalent of a wheelchair. This lady needs physical assistance, please, someone help her. She even like, she's the first moment she gets on a chair, she's like, I need that chair, and I'm like, poor lady. <laughs> yeah, um, I just got really tired of that, because it was like, um, You're all mine. and I don't know if Spirited Away came out first or after, um, but because I had watched Spirited Away first, um, all I could think of is like they were trying to do something similar to that, but like at least with Spirited Away, like the witch in that movie, she's just an old woman and her face is so extremely large and just overly detailed is all it is you know yeah i forgot her name is it alibaba i think so that was you baba it's you baba alibaba is the persona thing yeah code name for futaba i I thought Alibaba was also, like, the other Amazon. It is. It's, like, based no, no, that's it. on... Right. No, isn't yeah. it based on, like, an Egyptian thing? Mythos? I don't know. I have to look it up. I don't know where my phone is. Who knows? Are all of these I mean, it I would make ice. sense because, like, Futaba's really palace was, be. you know, just a lot of, like, Egypt. Exactly but, like, here? it's the same ancient Egypt well, aesthetic that we is, always go to for, like, Egypt instead of, like, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm a little tired of, like, using ancient Egypt as a gimmick. Mm hmm Like, we think, like, oh, it's ancient Egypt, and it's all abandoned, and it's just the pyramids, and it's like, no, there's, like, fucking civilizations literally around the gaze of- the ga the pyramids of Gaza. Yeah. And, like, there's cities, and it's- yeah, I don't know. Just, like, worried about that. Yeah, whatever. Um, that moment when you raid the kitchen, but are hit by the, uh, realization that there's only one snack left in the house. Oh no. Oh no. Did you say Pyramids of Gaza? Oh. Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm sorry. Giza? Isn't it just G-I-Z-A? Oh yeah, Giza. I don't Giza. I don't remember, okay? I can't remember words. Is it me? The frame rate is like slower. It probably is. Yeah, it's definitely looking slower on my end too. Oh, 
Yeah, Rex is moving so slow. Oh dang, level 4? That's pretty good. It means that Dromark has a lot of uh, trust with Mia. God, and trust takes forever. Or it can, at least. Yeah. Dolphin Carrot. <laughs> power in aid of my comrades well you see mercury dolphin carrot is basically you take some uh dolphin meat and you uh grind it in the gr meat grinder and then when it comes out in that weird and meshy then boop, you just buy a store-bought carrot and say it's a dolphin carrot because you gave up halfway through <laughs> Oh god. Sorry, go ahead though. Oh. No, I was just gonna I I'm just joking. Dolphins are olives. Speak! Speak, you give orders. If productions get more slow, maybe you ready for sleep time with fishes. Reduce load on neural circuits by twenty percent. That's yeah, really and then there's this like, like thing of like all the birds are evil. See, the so bird odd. people. The bird people that are also very oh, tribal coded or tribal aesthetic coded. What can I say but yikes? Oh, yeah, no worries, Mercury. They don't actually try to sync it <laughs> with the bird characters. Really, Dad upon Tatazo? Tora! Tada Pon! Tora miss you so much! I miss you too! And Rex is like, okay, which one of y'all wants to uh, give the father the bad news oh, that their great. son is... is wanted in 24, in 24 Titans? Oh jeez. <laughs> what is he doing? Oh, <laughs> that was not conveyed <laughs> well. The jiggle boobs fucking made me lose it. <laughs> Wonderful! They come here for you. You have good friends. Listen, I agree to abolish the carceral state, except for one person, Tora. May they suffer. I there say is no, no redemption. <laughs> oh, but I'll make an exception for Tora. If I may, I know there's a lot of catching up to do, but perhaps we should escape. A very good point. Damn, Come Tora, on, you Rex. got really. He's a, the father's right. like, wow, Tora, you have that's really so good friends, and like, that's the nail in the coffin where the people feel really guilty and have to go along with it <laughs> because they don't want to like embarrass him don't in front of their pair, in front of his father, and say, well, we're not really with friends with him, you know. We'll just, you know. We're just trying to abolish this state. Mui Mui give you information on purpose to lure you to factory. I can't believe scientists we just met at the beginning of the chapter turned out to be evil all along. Oh no, who could have guessed it? Finally I have chance to see his precious artificial blade. I'm just like, what's up with that swirly glasses? I wonder why that's like a trope. Wait, then, I, I just started listening to the audio of that. Did that did that scientist like did that scientist character have a French accent or was that still British? I don't even know these accents anymore. Um, it was an English accent, but it was with like a it was with something already topped on that. Okay, I don't know what accent that was, but it was... I mean, from that accent from the get-go, I was like, this guy sounds like a villain. Yeah. It's like... 
How do you say? Because, like, it's funny because it's... <laughs> the, the voice actor voices uh, a villain from the first game. Um, and I didn't even realize this until it was, like, um, pointed out. Good. At least we did that. Stone. Oh shoot, I'm gonna get my more food, so I'll be back. No worries. Hit me up if you need French villains. Mercury, if we need you to voice a French villain, would you um would you voice in a character? Tick of ho ho to every to the end of every sentence. <laughs> yes, thank you. How, how can you be so strong? Now we're gonna need some answers. What were you people plotting here? Oh, ordinary business. Well, I will do my best, we David Cage. And, artificial and add a horn horn. They threaten Tatazo and force to participate. I got the big sleep that just hit me. And next, you wanted to get your hands on Poppy. You are a greedy bunch. They're like, you know what? He's like, you know, what if you use the power of the artificial blades to, like, allow people who have a hard time summoning blades to have a blade? No? No, we're not going to redistribute back to the people and use this to create a revolution to overthrow our monarchist overlords and capitalist overlords? No? No? It's just me? Okay. <laughs> Why foos? Mui was part of group plotting to steal artificial blades all along. But waifus and Season of Means Productions both great. You can have your cake and eat it. In guild and had them attack laboratory. But what if I one day become what? a millionaire? Then it's all his fault that Grandpa How will I secure killed? my wealth I don't Indeed have? It was. A contact in the guild. Could it be that the one behind all this is Indeed, it is I. Mercury said Jupiter, do we agree their wings look like ears? Wait, those are their wings? I thought those were their ears. No, they're wings. Oh, I thought those were ears. No. That's why they flap. But I am nice, Nopper. You brought not only artificial blade to me, I think maybe because, like, I've been in this <laughs> longer than both of you have, I've accepted it. <laughs> but yeah. I thought they were, like, ears that they kind of used as wings, you know? No, they're wings. Oh, goodness. Chairman Banner. I can't believe you would stoop to this. You should show more respect after all the valuable work I fight for you. So, who are you planning <laughs> to sell the Aegis to anyway? Torna, I suppose. How you oh, know geez, about that's Banna, Naz. Wait, I remember you. You're one of Torna's drivers. B-A-N-A-N-A, -A -N -A -N -A, yes. What are you doing here? If you come for ether furnaces, they ready in ship outside. What? You're selling those to Torner as well? Not sure what is going on, but I will just beat you all up. Lila, take them all down. Mission acknowledged. Commencing combat. Tora, Alternative energy means to the people. The, the crime. I swear to god, the voice acting is perfect. The voice acting is perfect. There is no way to make it better. But 
make your best foot forward, Rex. Alright, already. Okay, um, let's start with... Let's do nuclear one. That we can do two, and then seal with water. Okay. So let's have Mia start fire. Oh, I see. Shit. Okay. Please, Mia. Do break. I resisted. Okay. Let's launch and smash. Oh no no, I did the wrong one. Okay, good. It's not quite a so bad it's good game, but like so weird it's good maybe. Yeah, like it's. I think like the game. What do I say? At times it's definitely so bad it's good, but I think like it's just like everything is just slightly off sometimes with like the delivery or like the unnecessary. Um, unnecessary pauses or like weird emphasis in like their sentences it reminds me of like the sonic adventure 2 and sonic adventure dubs <laughs> we're spinning We're not spinning, we're just good old vibing. Um, I'm enjoying the confusion in Jank. It is off, and that's the best part. Abilities. Okay, Sandstorm. I really do love Poppy's outfit. It's actually pretty cute. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, I'm really gonna launch. Crap. Oh, and I did. Uh, did someone say sandstorm? Yes. Do rid of sandstorm. That's that's my attempt to cover it. I feel like I'm... Was it... I feel like I most recognize, like, the song from when I was younger, from, like, the movie Big Fat Liar. 
Do you know what I'm talking about? It had like Amanda Bynes the in it. The one with Frankie Mann. Uh, yeah, Amanda Bynes and Frankie, uh, like, Munis? I forget what his Very last specific name is. people that you would not recognize unless you grew up in the 90s or early 2000s. Yeah. <laughs> in the U.S., specifically. Mm hmm Dynamic a punch. That's a fun name. If you could write attack names, how would you write them? Missile spill splurge, splurge, I mean. Would be like a missile barrage attack. I'm still okay. not thinking that, like, there needs to be, like, a world where, like, people call swords sticks. <laughs> You're like, I'll show you my stick. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, that stinks. Oh, well. QTE announcer, why though? Do not let her win, Poppy! Of course, Master Pawn. Comprehension error. Your integrated ether furnace is not fully activated. As an updated model, my energy throughput is superior. Energy efficiency, not the problem here. Poppy's master pawn told Poppy not to lose, so Poppy will win. Very simple logic. Comprehension error. And that not how it works, Poppy. I don't know what to, I don't know if you've seen Robot Fight or something like. I don't know what it's called, where like people put robots in cages and just destroy each other. <laughs> Wait, but the ones where, like, they win in, like, half a second. <laughs> <laughs> They're great. <laughs> mm -hmm. Do it, Poppy! Oh, God, what if the maid, like, she's like, Master Pawn said Poppy would not lose, so I will not lose. And then the maid just, like, shoots a laser out of her eye and decapitates Poppy's head, and it just shuts down. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tora. Uh, even if she no longer listened to me, even if she becomes oh, you don't understand. He's oh like Tora. I have, I have, I have a, I have, a, I have a confession to make. He's just like I built the fattest ass on her, and you can't take her out. Comprehension. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> like what? Like that, like he, like the confused look when people say, "Oh, she's so dummy thick," and it's a skeleton, and no Rex is just confused because, like, he's like, she's not that thick. What if he's like, Tora? Wait, I. She, he's on Tora. Wait, wait. I uploaded all my hentai on into her mainframe. I gotta re-download it back into a, into a hard drive before you destroy her. Oh jeez. Master Pond is Professor Susu and Professor Tatazo. What? She destroyed control device on her own! Damn it! Oh god, and they gave us an upskirt shot. Sister. Poppy. Oh god. Wait, I don't well, like how <laughs> cheerful she said, Poppy! <laughs> In that. Okay, ready for this, uh, 
Emperor's New Groove scene. Oh god, I remember the scene. Pull the lever, Kronk! Run mm -hmm. lever! <laughs> I hate how funny this is. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? You're like, you have this very serious scene, and then you have like this very comedic scene to just like straight up contrast it. So it's like, does yeah. this game want us go? to take it seriously or no? <laughs> Yes, but it won't. <laughs> also, just like... Oh my god. They had to have known when, like, animating that cutscene. Oh, jeez. And the funniest part is they only go to, like, this room that we can see outside the window. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh okay. god. Um with that though, I think this is a good stopping point and we'll have to pick this up uh next week. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, thanks Mercury for Mercury says Go ahead. Mercury said, did they just like Pacific Rim? It's been forever since I've seen that, so maybe. Um, yeah, thanks for being our hype person for the stream. Um, <laughs> we'll watch again. <laughs> yeah, thanks for hanging with us, Mercury. Um, we hope you have an awesome rest of your night here. Um, and take care of yourself. Bye. Later.